Hey guys, it's Josh Hunter with St. Greg Realty. We wanted to do a really quick video this October just to kind of give you some insight on maybe some planning for photography if you are looking to do uh, a listing, um, sell one of your properties, sell your home um, over the next six, eight months or so. Um, we never know when winter is going to start in Colorado and we never know when it's going to end. Uh, likewise, we never know how bad it's going to be. We've got some times where we've got green grass clear till January. Uh, we've got other times where we get snow like we did earlier this week, um, the first part of October. So if you're planning on selling a property or listing your home for sale um, over the next several months, something that we recommend is going ahead and getting some lake work done up front, primarily your photos. Um, we feel like it's ideal for us to have professional photography on all of our listings to really showcase in high definition really the ins and outs of, of your property. Um, Hey guys, it's Josh Hunter with St. Friend Realty. We're uh, with you today for a really quick video on if you are going to be selling your property um, over the winter in Colorado, uh, some things that might be helpful. One of, the, one of the most important ones that I'm gonna talk about right now is really photography. Uh, if you are considering that you may be listing your property sometime between, let's say, October um, and realistically even April, um, let's go ahead and talk to your realtor about getting some photography and artwork done ahead of time. Uh, biggest reason for that is that we want to capture, uh, you know, really nice high definition virtual tours, photos, etc., um, of really the things that make your your home pop. Um, and a lot of that is going to come down to two things. One, we've got our trees, our lawns, and our flowers. We want green grass. We want really beautiful flowers. Um, we'd love to have green trees or even, I really like this time of year because of a lot of our leaves are starting to change. So we get those rich oranges and reds, um, yellows, and, and some are still green too, but in case in point, they're not, they're not brown. Uh, they're not just branches or anything like that. Um, you also don't have snow on the ground. Um, not that snow is a bad thing, just when you are trying to, uh, you know, project your property out there to maximum audience. Um, everybody seems to love green grass, bright colored flowers, and nice looking trees. So you can get that done ahead of time. Also, lighting I brought up. Um, you can ask any photographer out there, especially kind of family photographers, the lighting that we get in fall is just spectacular. Sometimes we'll get those nice bright days that are just a little bit dulled, um, and it really produces some really, really nice, uh, nice photography and easy for them to edit. Um, Third, it's motivation. Uh, you know, if you're considering it, um, not too sure, etc. Once we show you how great those photos look, uh, we can guarantee you that um, once you look at our marketing plan or your realtor's marketing plan um, paired with the photos, uh, it's going to be pretty motivating to get you moving and get you excited about moving on to your next chapter. So anyways, just a real quick thing on there. I uh, just wanted to share that. If you are interested in selling your home over winter in Colorado, we highly, highly recommend um, a couple of things, but the one we're doing right now, photography. Call your, call your realtor and talk to them about photography. Have a great day.